this roadmap is all you need to master aptitude in five days because this roadmap is made by what work for me and other toppers who scored 15 out of 15 in aptitude i am raghuram chandra kumar m tech alum of iit madras Let's get started. Let's start by understanding all about gate aptitude, syllabus, patterns, and high weightage topics. Let me share one harsh truth about gate aptitude. There was a student from Tier 4 college. Yep, Tier 4 exists. It's one step substandard to Tier 3. Now you may ask why he joined Tier 4 college. As he writes, I was a never a good student at anything throughout my school. I remember in 11th class mid-year exam, I failed every other subject other than English and CS. But he fights. He started preparing for GATE in his second year. Like in his second year itself, he joined the leading coaching institutes and was consistent in their evening and weekend classes. Two years of hard work, he got all in there on 123, but he ignored aptitude. And that was his biggest regret. As he writes, I only got 9 out of 15 in aptitude. Even if I had 13 out of 15 in aptitude, then probably I would have been in top 60. The truth is, aptitude is easy, but not in a way that we can ignore it altogether. Now let's break down aptitude section. This section come guaranteed 15 marks for all students. It has a total of 10 questions with 5 1 marks and 5 2 marks and it has 4 main sections, verbal, quants, analytical and spatial. There is no fixed weightage but the highest weightage section is quants, then verbal, then numerical, then spatial. Now let me reveal the cheat code to master gate aptitude quickly. I know one friend at IIT Madras who cracked gate in just 3 months. He had a tough family background so after graduating B.Tech he had to work in industry. But few months in industry he realized it isn't for him. So he quits his job when his family is counting on him that two three months before gate and decided to prepare for it he was from mechanical but prepared gate production but still in three months he got all india rank 10 and joined iit madras one day while we are having tea he was sharing his gate journey and immediately i asked him how you have done it in three months he told reverse engineering he picked up past eight year previous paper and he studied like first he will look at first question he will search across resource to master that particular topic then answer the question likewise he completed first set of 65 questions and the same reverse engineering he did for all 8 year papers. Likewise, if we do reverse engineering on aptitude section of past 20 years papers across all stream, we'll find this pattern. Number 1. These 8 topic clusters can get guaranteed exposure to 10 to 12 marks. So we shouldn't miss these topics at any cost. Number 2. In the last 8 years, 82% of questions were being asked in previous year paper with just the values different. The new questions are usually verbal or geometry figure type of questions. So practicing previous year questions is sufficient number three verbal and spatial are easy these two are not up to level of cat exam hence we don't need to study its theory all we need to do to get good at it is practicing its pyqs and if you are looking for a complete list of aptitude topics from foundation to advanced use this as a reference to cover one by one and i have added links to access best free resources in a google sheet that you can access it with this qr code and this qr code will get access to past 20 years pyqs that is more than sufficient but a honorable mention for oswald book 16 years solve topic wise and chapter wise pvq aptitude booklet where they not only share the previous year question but also these booklets comprehensively discusses all the concepts in aptitude with mind maps and mnemonics for better understanding and memory this is actually an all-in-one organized booklet which will save you a lot of time hence i would recommend it if needed for you, I have added the links for these books in description. Check it out. Understanding the nuances, let's talk on a three-step strategy to get 15 out of 15 in gate aptitude in just five days. Step one, set solid foundation. This is Priyanshu Sarma. He secured gate CSAR2 by preparing just one month, that too in his final year of college. But not in the way you think. He had already secured all in the around 139 in his third year. But what he did was still a thing because after his first attempt, didn't touch gate preparation for 11 months. After that, he studied seriously for one month and got all in their rank too. I mean, I would like to say that if you have concepts clear, you will have a break for 10 months, so it won't matter. You will complete all the notes in 10 days. And that's our first step. Here is how you can get solid conceptual clarity. Out of the total 5 days, block the 3 days solely for foundation and execute this simple 4 step conceptual clarity framework based on science for each topic one by one. Which is step 1, take one topic. Step 2, understand the underlying idea of the topic. Step 3, solve 3 to 4 problems of different variety because There are a lot of questions repetitive. I would skip questions because there is also time and you don't get new learning. Step 4, make short notes including the concepts in one line or formula and important topics. Repeat this till you cover all the quants and numerical topics. Now come out of 4 step conceptual clarity framework and get into our 3 step aptitude strategy. Now once solid foundation had been built, it's time for 
step two get from foundation to 15 out of 15 let me share one unfair method to score 15 out of 15 in aptitude i knew a friend while my gate preparation day despite hard working when he started his full length test he wasn't able to score just 25 marks so in the last two months he took past 15 year papers and solved it one by one in time constraint with exam like conditions and between each test he worked down what he was lacking and did you know there are certain institutes which conduct offline center based exam before actual gate exam wherein he secured 46 and in his final exam he secured 71 so in step 2 take last year pyq of your stream solve just the aptitude section under time constraint one by one and in between each test analyze the test work on your mistake and your weak areas step 3 chase excellence now the problem is if we leave it untouched till exam we can't score 15 out of 15 and best stoppers i have studied they approach aptitude as a process to get excellence then study one and leave it all together hence post this five days every day block 45 minutes in morning and solve aptitude set from one previous year paper that may be from your stream or from other stream and i can guarantee you that 15 out of 15 is yours stay driven